Hi, welcome to Bella's Bargains. Um, so today is part four of our big Dollar Tree haul with my daughter and I. And um, so I'm not gonna show you the stuff that she got that was the same as me, but I'm gonna show you the stuff that she got that is different. So I'm gonna start with the arts and crafts stuff. Um, oh, and don't forget, I'm doing a calendar giveaway. So like, subscribe, share, make a comment. I'm gonna be sending out some calendars as soon as I get 56 followers. All right, so we're gonna start with this beautiful heart. Hi. Mm -hmm. Um, it's a heart shape, and she's going to decorate it up and make a Valentine's wreath out of it. It's a dollar, people. Super easy. I think she got some of, like, this. This is a tape. Actually, she got quite a few little colorful tape things, so she's going to make a Valentine's wreath out of that. These cute little tapes, um, just so you know, they are um, 21 inches, 2 inches, and nine, oh, 9 foot time by 2 inches. 2 inch wide. Nine feet long, not bad, cute, decorative. You know what I like to do with um, decorative tapes like this is identify something. For instance, like kayak, all my kayak stuff has lime green tape on it, so it's not confusing when I go to pack up, we know who's mine, who stuff, what stuff is mine. She also got some really cute Halloween forms and then a bunch of stuff to put on them. So she got the witch's hat. It's hard to see this, isn't it? But it's a witch's hat. And then the pumpkin, which I guess technically this would be fall, but <clears throat> she's got the pumpkin and the witch's hat. She's covering all the seasons, huh? But she bought a bunch of stuff to decorate these with. For instance, these cute little things I just started to show you. Um, they're just little floral picks. It's like the stuff that they do, you know, the feathery boas with. Feather picks, so super cute on the witch's hat that she's going to do. She also got the, the, this is a door hanger, which is, which is, legs and shoes but she's going to use it on the hat super cute and some really fun halloween ribbon um they've got so many cool patterns there these are nine foot rolls okay they're also wired so when you go to form a bow or something it's super easy to do and it's going to hold its form and then she got i love these like i want to send these to somebody i don't like like a dozen roses to somebody I don't like that are black with eyeballs in them. I like everybody though, so I guess I can't. But these would be so fun. She's gonna use them on her in her Halloween decorations. I think she's gonna use some on her Halloween witch's hat and some other stuff that she's bought for Halloween. Cute little, they have purple and black with cute little eyeballs in them. They're kind of scary little roses. Nice picks there. And then these Halloween balls, Christmas balls, I guess, ornament balls. But, um, these are just fun. I think there's so many uses for these. Put them on a candy dish in the center of your table. Just randomly hang them around somewhere or use them on a form like she's gonna do with some of those. And she also got this little string of purple um, LED string light. It's purple, so you can't really see in there. But these are fun for a dollar. It's just kind of a fun little thing to put somewhere to light up a centerpiece. She loves Halloween, so she's always got Halloween stuff. And this, just so you know, this requires, I believe, it's two AA batteries. Two AA batteries. They have all kinds of these, those for all different seasons. They had um, Halloween, fall, um, gardeny stuff, all kinds of different ones. You just got to keep an eye out because they're changing them all the time. She also got some fall picks. Again, I think for her pumpkin form, uh, really nice with the pumpkins on it. I love these. Um, they're just fun. And then this one with the berries on it and this pumpkin as well. She's got some of those to use for her uh, pumpkin form. And then one thing that Dollar Tree has really stepped up their game on is their, their forms for arts and crafts stuff. She got a lot of these. So she got hello, she got laugh, um, they have little ones. These, by the way, are those that same brand, that Heidi Swap that I showed you guys in the stickers. So there's all kinds of ones in here. There's, you know, stars and stripes and live and life and all that stuff. And then there's the Halloween ones, which this one says wicked. That's so cute, isn't it? Trick or treat. How cute is that one? And then, of course, we have to have happy Halloween. So I know she's going to paint these up and do some fun stuff at her house with them for her Halloween decor. And then she got some forms that weren't, of course, um, letters, but just the forms. I love these. So it's like the girl and the guy. You like those? So cool. And, of course, got to have a black cat. I'm assuming she's going to paint him black. 
for Halloween. Typical, your traditional pumpkin form jack-o'-lantern. And who doesn't need witch's shoes coming out of, um, cal what are those called? Cauldron? Cauldron, right? And then <clears throat> she got some other, I got, I think I've shown this to you guys, the Thankful Harvest Welcome, because I got these in my haul. Um, great for lots of things, not just for the fall season. And these are the new ones that they've come out with, the super thick, look at that, the pressed board, super thick lettering, hard to find. You can go to lots of Dollar Tree stores and you might find Gather, you might find Welcome, you might find, they have different words, Thankful I think is one of them. They're hard to find, so when you find them, you want to pick them up. For a dollar, how cute is this? And you can make different things out of its signs, you can just use it on its own, paint it up and decoupage it even. Um, there's one that says family and I thought how cute to decoupage the family one with black and white photos, just printed black and white photos on regular stock paper on the one that says family. It'd be super cool. Maybe I'll do that. DIY it for you guys. And then let's move. Oh, and she, we looked everywhere. She really wanted to get these pumpkins because they have the felt pumpkins. So she got the three different colors. Four, sorry. There's a white one too. These four different colors of the felt pumpkin, styrofoam form, and then they put the felt over it. They're really cute. And then she got one burlap one too. I really like the burlap ones myself. Um, and I thought how cute to take some ribbon, put it on here and just do like a little pile inside of a tin that they sell lots of those at the dollar store. Anyway, so she got a lot of decor stuff. So I'm gonna move on to the beauty stuff. She does a lot of um, gifts at Christmas time for little girls. She's got a lot of nieces. So she's always picking up hair stuff and she does a really good job. She knows her brands. She knows, well, I'm like, there's so much hair stuff. I can't even pull it all together. She knows what she's looking for. So one of the things is, one of the brands is Goody. Um, and so she got quite a few of just, these are just plain barrettes, but this is Goody. And I gotta show you what I love about these is they're like a large, oh, okay, get them out of there. They're like a large bobby pin, see that? So it's not a clip that you have to like clip, clip. It's like a large bobby pin, so you can just put it in. Love these, they're by Goody, so it's a good brand. Um, one of the things you have to worry about in hair thing is the finish that's on them. You wanna make sure it doesn't wear off too easily. Goody, you already know it, you know what it is, so you know it's gonna be good. And she got these really cool things, they're little, um, almost like a little, little toe ring sort of thing, but you put it into your hair and you braid your hair and you braid it through. So she has beautiful long hair and she does lots of braids with it all the time. And I think how cool would this be to, to enhance your very cool braid with. Then we have Remington and we all know another, Remington is another good brand name. So here, these are the same sort of thing. It's like a big bobby clip, but here they have like a little faux leather thing on it to make it a little more decorative. Love these. It's a dollar for four of them. So you're spending 25 cents for a good brand name, um, nice hair product. Just a regular clip, because I go through a thousand of these. I didn't buy this, she did. But also, goody, right? Good big clip. Um, yeah, so you can get a lot of hair in there. She's got a lot of hair. And then let's see, we got some more goody things. She got three of these, but I know she's always handing these out to these little girls. So it's just typical black, um, the rubber bands and then the decorative ones that they use like a bracelet. You've all seen when they do that. And then some bobby pins. So the thing about these two is that they're the no seam rubber bands, which is really good. Especially if you have thick hair and a lot of hair, you don't want to be ripping your hair out when you have the seams in them. So she's got some of those. And then these are great for little girls because it's a bracelet, decorative bracelet, but they can also put, put it in their hair and put the hair up. Um, let's say you're going to the swimming pool and somebody's got long hair. You put this on there. When you get to the pool, put it around the hair and you're good to go. Super cute, kids love the plastic bracelet stuff too, let's be honest. And then let's see, we got some more <clears throat> of the rubber band type things. She got, you know, like all different, I'm checking to see if I got them all. Nope, here's one more. Um, just the decorative ponytail holders in the pretty colors. They're the stretchies. Again, you can put these on like a uh, bracelet, so fun. And this one came with an extra little hair uh, ponytail holder. So she does lots of things with hairs for these little girls at Christmas time. And oh, and there's one more. I like this one because look, it's two patterns. So they took two of them, put them together, made it like a cute little bracelet thing, um, just fun colors. Also, uh, just, I don't think you can take them apart. So it's just two-toned, two-toned ponytail holders. I think they're cute as bracelets actually. Like, 
Hmm, I don't know. I really like those. Um, Remington. So this is like, remember slap bracelets? I love slap. I can't take this out because it's all thing there. But this is a slap bracelet for your ponytail. Right? How cool. Put your hair in a ponytail and you slap bracelet your ponytail holder around. This is a really beautiful color. I don't know if you can see that. It's almost like a periwinkle royal blue. Super beautiful color. Also by Remington. Can't go wrong with that. And then just a cute little bow, which is a clip, um, just a, uh, like a bob, I don't know how you call it. It's not a clip. It's just a open it, put it in, let it go bow for a little girl. And um, this is a head wrap. These are really cool. Um, actually, I use head wraps. This is going to sound really weird, but I'll put a head wrap on. It also doubles as a mask. So I can bring it down, put it back up, hair is back, down, close door, put it back up. Um, but the head wraps are really just a fun accessory sort of thing. Some people use it if you have curly hair and you want to plop your hair at night. I'm not sure if this one's big enough. Oh, I think it is though. I think it is. So perfect for that because it's the right kind of material. Some cool active style by Remington. Really love these. Super cute. These are a dollar. How cute is this? The two-tone. Love this one especially. Um, nice, soft. Rubber band is covered. Put your hair up. Little girls, put your hair up. It's active style. Um, if you can see the little picture there, see how she's got it around her bun, right? How cute is that? Especially little girls when they take dance. You put your hair in your bun, you can decorate it with these cute little scrunchies. Love them. Um, thick hair rubber bands. Amazing. These are amazing. I'm going to tell you right now, if you went to Walgreens, CVS, anywhere like that to buy these, you're going to probably spend $3 plus, a dollar at the Dollar Tree. And um, they're just for that super thick hair. I don't have super thick hair, but if I did, these I'd use them. Um, decorative ponytail holders. I think these are so cute. I had never seen these before. They look very like Moroccan or a little, um, you know, like a belly dancer kind of fun gypsy. Gypsy was what I was trying to come up with. So love these. Two, just two, two of them in there for a dollar. You can't beat it. They've got nice long um, holder on them. Really cute. Love these. And then I've gotten these before my, for myself. This is by Remington again, and it's a head wrap. So, you know, you put it on here. And have you seen where they tuck the hair into the, the rubber band part in the back? Super adorable for a dollar. And these, I can guarantee you, go to a, a department store, any department store. You're going to spend 15 plus for something like this. This is a really good buy. Love these. And then headbands for little girls. Love that. Little cheetah purple sparkly turquoise. Uh, dollars. So you're talking 33 cents each basically for each one of these. And it's, I don't know how to say this, but skun scunty, scunchy. I'm not sure how you say it. I should look that up. But that is a brand that we see around all the time. All right. So that was hair products. Got a lot of those. Then we got a lot of bath and beauty stuff. So one thing I love about the Dollar Tree is they have a ton of bath bombs. These make really good gifts. This is a Neapolitan bath bomb. And then she got some of these really sparkly, fun um, bath bursts here. So for dollar, um, little kids love to get in the bath. And I always feel like this is sort of the start of the beauty treatment that we teach little girls, get in the bath, put a bath bomb in. You know, we start them starting to love the sweet smells and the way their skin feels when they get out of a bath bomb. So um, really like those. Dollar Tree has an array of bath bombs and they're, they're just, you know, you can try them. Some of them are better than others. Just depends, but a bath bomb, especially with the kid, if it turns the color, the water color, they're gonna love it. So they had, um, uh, for I don't know how long, I don't think they have many of them left anymore, but Eco Tools, they must have bought something and they got some Eco Tools in. So Eco Tools are a really good name brand. Um, this is the Contour Perfecting Applicator, and these are the face mask sponges. Um, super good buy to get anything from Eco Tool for a dollar. Eco Tool for a dollar. Super good buy. So she got some of these. Um, I also got some of these. So I might have shown you guys these before. But anyway, they're it's really good. Fabulous find. Again, the th fun thing about the Dollar Tree is the hunt. You got to go on the hunt to find it. This is the silicone blender. So whenever you um, put on your makeup and you blend it, when we're using sponges and whatnot, what happens? It's like soaking up. It soaks up so much of your makeup. You end up spending more on makeup than you need to because you're wasting so much of it on a sponge. So with a silicone blender, you're putting it on. You're not wasting. It's not soaking up your makeup. So I don't know. It's pretty good. So this is by Swispers, the silicone um, blender. Nice little thing. They have all kinds of masks. This one is the mermaid face mask. 
First of all, my daughter thinks she's a mermaid, so I think if it says mermaid, she won't buy it. Um, so I haven't tried this one, so I can't tell you, but the thing with their masks is they're only, they, again, they're only a dollar. A dollar, people, a dollar! And you can make yourself feel like nice, cool, refreshed, whatever. There's all kinds of them. There's charcoal, there's, you know, sea salt, there's just everything, depending upon what you're looking for. Um, lip Glop Surprise. This is more, it's probably more like a toy than it is a makeup thing, but for little girls, you open it up, and there's a surprise lip gloss in there and you don't know which one you get. I've said this before on my previous things. Kids love surprises. So if you can buy them something, they don't know what's inside and they get to open it and find out what's inside. That's the best, they love it. And this is only a dollar. Um, so she got some tooth stuff. Uh, this is Reach, Reach Tooth Brushes. So again, name brand, um, 50 cents toothbrush, really not a bad buy. The thing is, uh, I don't know about you, but I'm always picking up toothbrushes because you got to replace them. You got to rotate them through, get get out the old ones, put in the new ones. So really nice buy for the Reach toothbrushes, two for a dollar. Um, Bior. We, I think we all know Bior, right? It's a name brand. So this is their charcoal cleansing micellar. I don't even know how to say that. Anyway, water. Um, so this is a cleanser, great for oily skin, and it's charcoal. Charcoal is really in right now. I mean, we brush our teeth with charcoal, now we're washing our face with charcoal, we put charcoal in our hair. Uh, you know, charcoal, everything right now. So this is a nice little find. Again, these are so perfect for like a stocking stuffer or in a gift basket, or if you want to do a preteen or a teen basket of some sort, so Bior Charcoal Face Cleanser. Ah, secret, shh, it's a secret. For a dollar, hmm, not bad. I mean, that's a pretty decent buy. Um, I know for all you coupon, couponers out there, you can probably get this for free. But if you're not a couponer and you're going to the dollar store, it's nice to pick up some of your essentials for hygiene at a reasonable price. So secret deodorant for a dollar. All right, let's go into the toys because she's got kids and she's always buying stuff for kids. Never seen these before and I think they're so cool. So this is a chalk burst. Can you see that? Chalk burst, here's the thing. Put your kids in some old t-shirts, send them outside in the field or out in the backyard or whatever, give them a chalk burst and they can start throwing it at each other. Whoever comes in with the most burst on their shirt is the loser, the least is the winner. I don't know, anyway, just kind of a fun thing. So there's chalk and it's like a hacky sack bag, right? And throw it and it bursts onto the person that you throw it at. Fun little thing for kids to play. Okay, so I think these are really ugly, but she picked them up. And so, but they are ugly dolls. <laughs> these are ugly dolls. Um, okay, but ugly's kind of in. Like seriously, think about the troll movie, right? They're ugly and they're in. So she picked up some of these ugly dolls. I know she's gonna give them to some of her nieces and nephews and whatnot. Um, they're just ugly. What can I say, they're ugly. But they're only a dollar, people, only a dollar. And then we found in one store, which these were hard to find. Um, actually, the ugly dolls were too, I should go back. They were a hard find. And the Lost Kitties, and this is, um, who's hiding inside? Another one of those, you guys know I love surprises for kids. So does my daughter, she picks these up. So there's 36 to collect in 2018. So apparently that's why they have them at the dollar store because they're from 2018, I'm not sure. Anyway, fun, fun, fun. There's little kitties in there, little different kitties. You open it up, you find out which one you have. Lost kitties. These are just the cutest thing in the whole world. Shopkins, you guys remember Shopkins? I mean, they're still around. So these were these little miniature Shopkin things and guess what? There's a Shopkin inside. How cute are these? So this is the sweet, this is like a bag of candy. This one's like little ice cream. This one, I don't know for sure what it is. Cookies or something. Um, and these are like crackers. How cute, right? Perfect. Little girls, I think especially. Like seven, eight, six, seven, eight. Little girls like that love those little miniature things. It's hysterical. Let's get into stationery and stuff like that because that's always fun. Okay, she picked up these magnets. And they are just, they're just really nice. They say he will stay in God is love. There's just, so they're bookmarks that are magnets. So you can see it's two-sided, right? Well, because when you throw it over the page, it magnets together and the pages in between. Great little gift for 
you know, grandma and grandpa's or something like that. Just fun little magnets. And then all of these journal things or little, um, just little notepad things. But see the inside, there's lines and there's some graphics in there. So this one, trolls, trolls, of course. And this is little my little pony and my little pony. So again, she picks these up, I know, for the little girls or nieces that she has to give stuff to, you know, and whatnot. And they're just fun. The troll stuff you're finding because that movie came out and not in theaters. It had to come out at home. So I think some of the stuff just didn't move. So we're finding it some pretty good deals. This is a student planner. It says, seize the day. Um, just kind of a simple little planner. And then she picked up these really cute little things, stickers for the seize the day planner. How cute are those? The little mermaids. I love the stickers at Dollar Tree. I think they're amazing. They do a fab, they have a fabulous array of stickers. Some of them you got to go on the hunt for. This is a little journal and it's got the, all the, um, what are they called? Sagittarius, Cancer, Taurus, all those things. Horoscope guys on them. And a matching pencil bag that she picked up. Super cute. Love that. I'm going to move really fast here. Maybe I can get all this in. I don't, yeah, we're going to get it all in. Let's just go for it. They have these there. This is a great idea. It is a book. And it's like this one says, follow your dreams. They know the way. And then there's an envelope. If I open it up, I can show you the envelope. There's an envelope inside. And what you do is you mail or you give somebody a book as a card, an inspirational book. So um, I think these are like really good. Actually, like as a graduation present or something because you can write something in there. See, that's the envelope. You can actually mail these. And this book is Follow Your Dreams. And it's got sayings inside of it, all the pages. Um, I want to do one and write special messages on each page for somebody that I send it to. So she got the Follow Your Dreams, Faith, and He Who Plants a Tree Plants a Hope. That one. Anyway, these are really cute. A dollar. This is If this was a name brand in some fancy store or even a drugstore, these are going to be five, six, seven dollars each, right? So picked up a few markers. They always have a nice array of markers, especially back to school time. She picked up some of those Heidi swaps. Again, these are just uh, things for like scrapbooking or making cards. I love her stuff. It's really beautiful. Do you see the sparkly in there? It's just really beautiful. Love that stuff. And then brand new, they had a bunch of Dr. Seuss stuff. Um, <clears throat> it's in their school section for teachers, but uh, it's so bright and colorful. I love it. This is bookmarks. These are stickers. She picked up those things, I think, for some, I don't know if it was party papers or something. How adorable, though. They had erasers. They had markers. They had a lot of Dr. Seuss stuff. And again, some stores would have some of the stuff. Then you'd go to the next store, and they'd have other stuff that was Dr. Seuss. So if you hunt, you can find it. These are pocket dividers. They're really beautiful graphics on these. Okay. Love this. Beautiful graphics on these. Um, I'm not sure if she's using them for pocket dividers or if she's using them for the graphics because this is really good stuff. But dollar, super cute. There's two in, there's two packs in here. And they, if you can see in there, there's a pocket on them too. So when you put it in your planner, there's a pocket for putting stuff in. Really cute. Um, <clears throat> she wants to learn calligraphy. So she picked up these crayolography. That's really hard to say. These are cool because they walk you through learning calligraphy. Um, can't beat it. They tell you which markers to use. Um, and it's just, oops, sorry. It's just fun. And if you want to learn, if you do scrapbooking or anything like that or cards or whatnot, it's really fun to have a creative way to write things. I'm going to go on to books. Everybody should be looking at books when you go to the Dollar Tree because they're a dollar. <laughs> yeah. You got it, a dollar. This is a great set. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight books. So this is an $8 gift, all right? I know what she's doing. This She's giving this to her sister. And it is, they have love, goodness, grateful, gentleness, I'm sorry, kindness, faithfulness, peace, self-control, and joy. Inside these, so these are just really cute. It's just a little quick book that it's almost like a, you, you learn, you know, you read, you answer questions, you learn stuff and fun for a couple maybe that's doing some self, uh, 
uh, teachings on love and so on and so forth. Uh, just fun. Eight dollars. This is a great little series. Love that. Movies. Obviously, we're always looking at the movies they have there. Can't beat these for kids. This is the Hot Wheels one. This is the Monsters Monster High one. A dollar. And can you see what color is the package? Blue. Why? Because they're Blu-ray. Do you remember when Blu-ray came out and they were like twice as much as a regular DVD? Not at the Dollar Tree. Mm -mm. Sit right. They're a dollar. She picked up this little book called Baby Moses. Um, so this is a step two reading book. They have all these reading books for kids. They're great because at the different levels they can learn to read. Step two reading right here. Um, so this is probably, I'm going to guess this is probably like first grade level about here. And uh, just fun little book for a little kid. And she brought this to read for herself. It's called Bright Young Dead. Here's the thing. I'm not even going to, we don't even need to know what the book is about. This is the book. It cost a dollar. It was $26.99 originally. And she just bought it for a dollar to read to herself. Here, little tip though. Can I tell you something? And I'll do this for you. DIY from Dollar Tree stuff. Pick up books like this. You get a couple of them. You bind them together. You spray paint them. And they make the cutest display things for a really nice piece of pottery or something like that. I'll do it. I'll show you guys. Love that. Okay? For a dollar. Uh, let's go into some of the cleaning supply. They had scrub a bug. This is a scrubber made specifically for cars to get the bugs off the windshield, the headlights, and all that. Love that. A dollar. They have great car stuff there. You want to do a basket full of car stuff. You, easy. Never seen these there before, but these are the Job's fertilizer spikes. If you're growing indoor plants, these are great, and they work really well. So she picked some of those up. And apparently everybody's getting a pair of gloves. I don't know. Like, that's a lot of gloves. But these are the nitrile coated. These are really nice gloves. Um, is it this way? I think it's this way. Yeah. And this is a name brand for a dollar. There's two in there, by the way. It's a pair of gloves for a dollar. She also picked up some of the calendars. So she got some of the same ones that I've already shown you, but she got two additional that I didn't show you. So this one is God's Promises. Um, again, like remember I talked to you about the graphics in these posters? I mean, in these calendars, the graphics are so cool. So I really love this one. He keeps his eye upon you and it's the seashell one right there i just think they're really beautiful they'd be so pretty framed and whatnot and the other one she got was bible verses and so this one is just beautiful scenery um i would say of god's creations right isn't that pretty these are a dollar they're stupid the calendars i gotta say super impressed really beautiful last thing we're gonna do is food so um Okay, they always have candy. Honestly, there's an entire, entire aisle devoted to candy, so I'm not gonna go into it much, but we all know you can get good stuff there. These are the tahini chili and lime peanuts. Well, you know, a buck. It's not like a great deal, but it's not bad. We got, she got some uh, sour, whatever, sour bright mystery night crawlers. Are you gonna go and fishing? I'm not sure. Um, some red vines. I think these are all snacks for the air and play ride home, but creme de la creme is when you can find this. So this is Charms Cotton Candy. Now, uh, you can find the cotton candy every Dollar Tree you go to. What you can't find is the sherbet. You can't find it. This is rainbow sherbet cotton candy with the unicorn on it. It's amazing stuff. You can't go wrong with it. If you find it, buy it. Kids love it. Make them eat it outside though, just FYI. All right, so that's it. That was her haul. She got a lot of stuff. I got a lot of stuff. Now I'm going to come back. I'm going to do my next video is going to be a D DIY on a piece of clothing I got from the Dollar Tree. You might want to see that. Hmm. Clothes from the Dollar Tree? Who would have thunk? I did. All right. Ready? I'm going to give away. I have seven calendars. These are just representing a few of them um, that are really, really nice calendars as soon as I get 56 followers. So I need you to like, share, comment, like, share, comment, subscribe. All those things that you do on YouTube, can you do that for me? Right? Okay, we're gonna see you the next time with that DIY clothing piece from the Dollar Tree. We'll see you next time on Bella's Bargains. Bye.